What's going on guys? My name is Jack. Welcome back to another video here on my channel. Today is a pretty cool one. Also a pretty simple one. It's going to be how to send and receive files with freelance clients. Now this right here is pretty obvious. All I really do is use a file sharing website like Dropbox. You know, you, you could use the other ones. I don't literally don't even care about the names of them. Dropbox is about the only one I care about. You know, <laughs> <laughs> um, well, how could I not remember the other ones? Um, fucking some data transfer nonsense, right? Uh, but you obviously know the ones I'm talking about, right? Google Drive, stuff like that. Uh, Dropbox, in my opinion, is my favorite. Tell me if there's one that's a better deal or something like that. I don't know. Dropbox, just the layout of it seems the most intuitive to me. Like Google Drive, just it just gives me sort of weird weird stuff. I can't even really explain it, to be honest. It's definitely just a mental problem. <laughs> but uh, basically, I'm going to show you how to send and receive files with freelance clients and uh, you know to me this was obvious but quite a few of you have kept asking this that I thought I'd make it a topic and uh, I'm actually in Rome right now by the way so I'm not even in England right now I'm recording this video a week before you're gonna see it and uh, I'm currently in Rome but I think I'm back later today on the day that I post it but on screen is Dropbox right and this is my file sharing uh, go-to website right so I'm gonna walk through the process of receiving the files from a freelancer and also sending the files to a freelancer right so to actually send files to a freelancer, literally all you would do, I, I, I mean, my bad, send files to a client, like sending it back to them, right? So say, actually, should we go through this chronological? All right, screw it. I'm going to open my email. I'm going to show you what it would look like if a client sent you some files and how to get them, right? So say I open up my email, it's jackcoa.gmail.com. Email, email me if you guys need anything. And right here at the top, it says clips for the project. So it looks like a client has just emailed over some clips. We click it and it says, here's the clips. Need this done for Thursday if possible. All right, cool. So they're telling us when, you know, when it needs to be done. They've got the Dropbox link to download the clips. And they then say, all the best, your favorite client. So this is obviously for my favorite client, uh, aka me. Uh, and I click on it, and this is a RAR file, right? So they might send you literally just the clips, which means you could just download the actual individual clips. Or if it's multiple, they might send you more likely a, uh, you know, a RAR file. And then, uh, you know, you could download it. Um, and it's going to say client clips and, you know, essentially we've just downloaded our clips for whatever project we need them for. Right. And then we can simply load up, you know, some, uh, some, some place to actually extract them to or whatever. For example, you know, we fucking go into here, this YouTube video folder that I got right down here, just literally drag them in and, uh, you know, bada bing, bada boom. We've now got that in there. We can then let's make a new folder right here. <sighs> client new folder, screw it drag that in there, new folder, and then we can extract our clips here and bada bing, bada boom, we've just gotten the client clips that they sent over. Looks like it's gonna be a pretty small project. They only sent us two clips. Obviously, these are complete examples right here. I assume you guys will be receiving loads of clips, right? So they'll send you a link. And uh, more likely, it won't even be a RAR file. It could just be a, a thing full of plenty of clips, like like two seconds. Let me literally just find a folder one time, right? Date modified, blah, 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 descending. Uh, Ascending, maybe I don't even know how the fuck do I find these things. Okay, cool. So look at this, DJ Will, right? This is more accurately what it, what a folder for the clips will look like. So this is clearly some clips I sent to a DJ or something after I filmed the club, right? And it's just a folder full of loads of clips. You then literally just highlight them all, click download, and you know just start downloading them again. It'll condense it to a RAR file just like that down there, right? So that's how you receive. How would you send a project? Again, literally mind-blowingly easy. Again. All you do is come to your favorite file sharing website. For me, it's Dropbox. And I'm literally just going to go to upload files. Then I'm going to go over here to my computer. I'm going to go to my record drive, finished projects. And let's let's send them something. Let's send them this, you know, this, which one? Any Anything. Like, a, you know, we, we, we could literally send anything right here. Screw it. I'm going to send Hours London, this, this promo video, uh, or slash after movie me and my homie Noah did for a uh, pretty what's called high ticket restaurant up in London called Hours Restaurant. I'm going to click open. I'm going to click Dropbox, right? So it's the main folder and click upload. And just like that, you can see down there, it's uploading. And once we've uploaded this file to Dropbox, which is only going to take a couple minutes, right? Once it's actually uploaded to Dropbox, we can then create a link, right? So can, can I be able to sit here and, and wait for this to upload? Not really. So I'm going to show you what it would look like, right? If we wanted to actually share the link once we've uploaded it, pretend that this video here, Barky Banner, uh, is the uh, Hours London thing, right? All we do is hover over it, go here to share, click share, and click create link. Create the link, copy paste the link, and then, you know, we go over here, we'd say, hey client, uh, I got it done and 
dusted, and it's only Wednesday. Wednesday. Boom, link it up. All the best, and let me know about the next project. Uh, Jack. Boom. So, not only have we received it, but we've now sent it off, done and dusted to the client. The client's going to be very happy to receive that uh, a whole day early. Look at that. They said they wanted it for Thursday. We've sent it on a Wednesday. We are changing the game out here. We are really killing it. And, uh, you know, bada bing, bada boom. Um, very, very simple. That right there is literally how to transfer and receive, aka send and receive files with freelance clients. And just like that, I appreciate every single one of you guys for tuning in. Thank you for watching. Like I said at the beginning, it was a simple one, but I'd seen it being asked a fair few times. And when I see you guys asking the thing a fair few times, why would I not make a video on it, right? So thank you guys for tuning in. Have a nice day. And just like I said at the beginning, I'm in Rome currently. So I'm out there in the Coliseum, the Vatican, eating some pasta, some pizza, and some gelato. And uh, like I said, you'll be seeing this the day I think I'm coming back because I've prepared so much content for the week I'm away. So hell yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with fresh videos. Thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Have a nice day.